Thank you. So, um, you guys should watch my, my reviews of uh, the TNG movies and, and also the Star Wars prequels. Sweet home Chicago. <laughs> you wanna go sweet home Chicago I think we need more reverb <laughs> <laughs> no. turn up no. all the gay <laughs> welcome to the random shit panel that's the first annual maximum we do random shit panel uh, sorry I got nothing to add. We need to check IDs. Sorry, it's 18 plus. <laughs> Sorry, it's 39 plus. <laughs> it's 69 plus. Hot. Uh, so, like, we need to verify your ID or and or presence of granny panties. It's maximum. We have a random shit now. We're talking about random shit. There's only one person to talk about it with. So. Apparently, Ty comes in, students come out. Could you explain that to me? Ty has an amazing lifting action that uh, combines with the detergent and takes a lot of, solidifies with the water to create a watertight, amazing, stain removing system. So that's how Tide works. It's available in the uh, cleaning section of Menards or your local uh, local uh, supermarket. So get Tide today. Tide Podge, just don't eat them. And you on the left, can you explain Tide Line Blue? <laughs> Hi, welcome random to the panel. Welcome to the random shit panel. Woo! <laughs> oh my god, something actually came in. <laughs> <laughs> Honest to God, we just sat here and now we're just playing with the microphones and they haven't kicked us out yet. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know what? That works. Tell your friends to come text all your buddies. <laughs> text all our buddies. Hey, I'm probably my buddies. <laughs> Hey, welcome to the Random Shit Panel. We're talking about random shit. Come on in. We'll talk about stuff. So, uh, speaking of Tide, if you're those Tide Pods, look like candy to children. Yeah, Tide Pods, man. You, you heard about the Tide Pod incident? Like the some kid that ate one? Yeah. What? They look There's like a kid that ate one. They ate one that died. Tide Pods? Those colorful ones? That look like candy? Wait, I'm probably... It's, not, it's really not... It's not Tide's fault that... That they look no. like candy. It says "Do not give to children" on the side of the thing, on the oh, side of the box. Keep on the reach it's, kind of, oh, it's kind of parents. You got to be vigilant. I need to kids keep on reaching Keep that stuff away apparently. from them. Because I mean, it does look like candy. And even as an adult who knows she shouldn't eat one, I still kind of want to eat one. Well, and then if they put it, ne- I mean, if they blatantly put it next to the candy aisle and said "Tied pods with candy in it," but this is this is clearly it's not. It's just tied. It just meant to clean. With the cotton candy flavor. Ty, okay, go to the random shit panel. Hey, go go to the bathroom, watch you pee, and then come over in here. Just don't pee in here. So, where are you two from? Rozo, Minnesota. Oh, drove all the way from Rozo? Yeah. Dang. So, do you go to the other con- any other cons or? No, just this one. <laughs> what about you? You going any you going any other cons or? First one. Oh, this is your first. Oh, okay, it's your first. Hey, come on down. We're talking about stuff. Yep, go ahead. I'm sure All right, have a nice day. Yep. And always save big money at Menards. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is your first con. I'm sorry. I'm so, sorry. No, it gets better. <laughs> yeah, it gets, it, so there's other cons out there. So, like, at least you didn't end up at Icon in Winnipeg for your first con. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm just off the guest, or one of the guests. <laughs> it was. We pissed off a voice actress. You ever, uh, you watch much anime? I guess it's kind of a redundant question, but you ever hear? You know who Tiffany Grant is? Name something she's played. Awesome. Oscar Wangley. <laughs> and even Galleon. Uh, she was the Madam President in Golden Boy. She was, <laughs> oh God. Yeah. You know what we're talking about? Well, CJ and Mike's all yours. Go tell them about the story. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah, I, I was new to anime and didn't know who she was or anything. Uh, I, I, was, I was informed that uh, she was in the uh, Sakura-Con uh, commercial. Sakura-Con? Sakura-Con Kikimon! Yes, however you say that. Um, and that, that's how I kind of learned about who she was. And uh, we, we were all wandering around the con doing the, the Garuga Mesh thing as a joke. Garuga To the point that we started to get uh, recognized by just random people. 
Uh, on Sunday, I, I thought it would be like a cool idea to go up to Tiffany Grant and uh, see if we could get a, a group picture of, of her with her doing the Garuda Mesh thing. And my way of approaching this was to uh, ask her if she likes sushi. I was in a group with him. It she does, apparently. <laughs> I was in a group. So I was like, kind of like next to him. We were basically flanking him. Even though I was standing next to him, I still felt guilty just by association because she just turns around and she says, I do like sushi, but I know what you're getting at. <laughs> apparently the internet ruined that kid's life. I know, she was just like, you know, the internet ruined this kid's life, and he was just trying to play, and I was just like, Vic Vignone, we were just doing what Vic Vignone had told us to. <laughs> and she just freaked out. I'm just like, I, I, I did not say a word, yet I still feel like I'm caught in a shotgun blast. And she's this demure little, she's small, she's like four, five foot at best tall woman, about half his weight, and still made, him, made us all feel like we were like half a foot tall. <laughs> no, seriously, they, this incident, it caused shockwaves throughout the universe. Like, I dropped a case of beer almost to the moment this happened. Oh, God. I was in the parking garage, like, six floors away, and still I felt it. I sensed it. There was, like, a disturbance there was in the a force. disturbance in the force, and he dropped an entire case of Fort Gary. There, really? no, there is nothing sadder to a Canadian than a broken case of beer, let me tell you. Oh, I got more God. than a few looks of shame. <laughs> Depends on the shame, beer. Shame. So yeah, that's how we uh, pissed off a voice actress. It was, uh, I, I, and then the funny part is we just shuffled off into a random elevator trying to just to get the hell out of there. And then we just, unfortunately, our yeah. luck, it was an elevator that went down one floor and goes right back up. So we went down, the door opened, and then this guy just pokes his face in and says, yeah, I, I don't like sushi, uh, I don't like sushi either. Just kind of jokingly, and just we're just like, oh, that's nice. And I was just like, ah, oh, she does actually. <laughs> then the doors close, and then we just kind of move on. Down the floor, get off. Yeah, we were just trying to get to the garage. I mean, at that point, we were oh, just. I think we're heading up to a room actually. Oh. Good stuff. Oh, yeah. That, that was actually the fun thing about Icon, is that you would just randomly run into guests. I didn't do it anything. Anything. <laughs> You could tell. So, yeah. Uh, that was my first time. What are you guys doing? Where are you going? Is it Halloween already? <laughs> yeah, we had some guy tell us that. Ask that. No. Read in the paper. <laughs> Been on TV for like two weeks. It's, it's Valley Valley Con. Con. Yeah. yeah. I was dressed up as the government earlier, so I got a lot of like. Even when I went out in the public, like I had my yes or open That's sign. That's what you were. Uh, yes, I was the government. I was the yes or open sign. I went to Family Dollar and still got people. Left. So I was like one of those sort of cosplays that gets laughs outside the con. But yeah. <laughs> I'm sure no one knows who Question. I am. So. We had a couple people go. <laughs> I had quite a few stares yesterday. I was a fairy and I was poking people in the face. And you had that tiny little skirt on. Hey now. That probably yeah. <laughs> you should go to Convergence. There's actually people from Convergence here, so it's totally cool to like plug Convergence at this con. Well, technically, I think the whole thing is just like Convergence because you know they do the room down there, right? Yeah. It's, they, they bring the, like half of the Star Trek bridge down for their party room at Convergence. Uh, oh, that's awesome. It's like a satellite thing. And it's, uh, yeah, actually, probably the, uh, the guy running the thing is the Captain Kirk who's always there at their room party. <laughs> Explains why his bash name is Captain Kirk. <laughs> But yeah, this is your first, so you're both from Ozo, and this is your first con, so, um... This is her first con. Oh, what's your, have you been to cons before? Returning to this one. Any other cons you've been to, or...? This one last year. Alright, well, that's a couple, um, cons are fun, you know, I'd suggest if you ever saved up the money, I know Rosa's kind of remote. Um, go to other cons, too, there's other cons out there, like, you're kind of closer to Winnipeg than here, maybe, I'm not too sure how it is from Rock. Been there once. It's like... <laughs> I think, hours. yeah, it might be closer. Because got, they got Icon up there, there's enemy yeah, detour yeah. in the cities. Yeah. that look clear to you? No. <laughs> trying to make ramen or something? Or? No, I'm trying, trying to get fangs. Oh, what? oh you're, you're building them up with, like, plaster? No, um, they're fake fangs from a, a, a Halloween shop, and they have to... It's stupid. I think I'm going to give up. <laughs> uh, yeah, are they glue on or something or what? Uh, yeah, they've got like this uh, 
poly inside the tooth that you put in hot water and it's supposed to go clear and then you're supposed to shove it on your tooth and uh, it, 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 um, it tried this and I thought she was going to break a tooth. It sounds like tooth breakable, yeah. <laughs> it's just a tooth, right? Yeah, you can get new ones. You can get a, you can get a fang in place of that one. Yeah, right? I'll you get a real one. one. Well, I have, when I was younger, I was so obsessed with anime, I said I was going to buy a dog with a really fluffy white tail, and then when it died, I'd have the tail preserved and then become a Nico. <laughs> Wasn't that weird? I don't know, I guess. Yeah, that, yeah. Was weird. that was when I was going through a really weird phase. Well, at least you admit it's a weird phase. I mean, everybody has weird phases, so. <laughs> That's okay. Yes, but usually they don't want to surgically attach dog's tail to their butt. Yeah, that's true. It, it, you know what? It was a brilliant idea. No, it wasn't. It, it was a good idea at the time. Exactly. It doesn't mean it was a good idea, like, for the rest of your life. <laughs> kind of like tattoos. They were good at the idea at the time, but then you're like, oh. Why? Why? There's a tattoo. There's a tattoo of a butterfly on my butt. Why did that happen? <laughs> when did that happen? Yeah. I don't remember. You ever wonder if butterflies ever get a craving to, like, get a tattoo of people on them? <laughs> They don't live long enough. Well, you know, there's got to be a butterfly tattoo parlor somewhere. Makes sense. You never know. But yeah, just go to more cons around the country, or at least you know, within driving distance. So I want a dream con is to go to Dragon Con down in Atlanta. Oh yeah, I heard about that one. Yeah. Oh god, that's that's an ultimate go-to, or Soccer Con, or even so just. Con, Nikki, whoa. <laughs> I've been in Japan, period. You know I've been in a fucking country before. <laughs> exactly. That's exactly what it is. And then I don't know if I want to go to Japan, because have you heard of Taiji? Taiji? Taiji. No. Taiji, Japan is a place where they sal slaughter dolphins. Hmm. So that time. Very big activist. Yeah. Is there, is there dolphins tuna safe? <laughs> oh. Oh, man. Bad joke. Bad oh, that's a joke, good man. That was terrible. Actually, they slaughter dolphins every year for months at a time, and then they sell dolphin meat, which should be illegal because their mercury content is actually kind of lethal to humans. But they still sell it and donate it to the community schools because they want to be community activists. Um. And yeah, let's poison our children. There are. <laughs> that, that's weird. That's really weird. Japan's weird. Weird. Yeah, there's there's a lot of weird in Japan, including my girlfriend. <laughs> girl in Japan. Girl in Japan. Under the sun there. Under the right sun. <laughs> Yeah, no, that's no, what I'm isn't, isn't that ex I've been called out? I, I have one of those girlfriends. But I can attest that she that, that this person is actually real because I actually helped those two meet, so Aww. had the had the transmission on my, my Ford Taurus never gone out, we would have never been able to drive my Camaro from Las Vegas. We would have never gone through the cities and he and her would have never met, probably. But that uh yeah, it's that's a good story. So Aww. so yeah, their, their love is based on a broken tranny. <laughs> And she, well, you know, it, she's she's into Rocky Horror, so she is a tranny. So uh, no, oh. yeah. <laughs> I see what you did there. Saw what you did there. Speaking of Rocky Horror, if you're willing to make another trip from Roseau to the Grand Forks area, I'm uh, I'm going to be in my sixth year as a Transylvanian in the Rocky Horror Picture Show next week. At the Empire. Empire yes, uh, I'm in that every year. It's going to be my sixth of you know. I was there last year. Oh yeah, I don't remember you, and That's I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> That's um, okay. There's like a thousand of them who go to the show every year, and one of me and uh, some of the cast. So yeah. Oh, totally understand. Um, Cody, you know Cody. Cody, yeah, 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 or, uh, yeah, or, yeah, yeah, Eddie, Meat yeah, love. yeah, mm -hmm. basically Meatloaf, yeah. Yeah. Didn't do anything for love, but I won't do that. Is, Fair it, is Angie returning? I don't know. We should figure I, I out where to go is. to sign up for the costume contest. Oh. Mm. That's over yeah, by that's the... Woodland South. Yeah. Woodland South, yeah. Yeah, if it's not registration. Because they're doing the concert, I don't know. They're probably doing line control, so maybe try registration. Like, well, yeah. registration's closed. Well, they're they're done. They're full. Oh, oh yeah, they were folded up. There. Yeah. yeah, there's no. One. Welcome to the random stuff. Never mind. Just walked away. <laughs> <laughs> just, um, just you know, join the lineup. Right the the Come on down. We'll talk about anime again. <laughs> you know?
So what enemies are you all into? Ruby. Ah, oh, Ruby. Do you even know what Never Ruby heard of it. is? Uh, well, tell us about Ruby. Do you Ruby. Know what rooster teeth. Is? Rooster teeth. Oh, that one. Yeah. Yeah. Ruby. I guess yeah, I'll it's their new of thing. Um, oh, it's so wonderful. Inuyasha. Really <laughs> yeah. Who would have thought, right? Um, Naruto. Cowboy Bebop. Cowboy Bebop. <laughs> Thank you, people, for your attendance. Sorry. I'm more a PBS person. PBS. Um, I'm sorry. I get six stations of PBS. You make do with what you got. Okay, we're on again. Okay, yeah, so we, we just decided to sit down in an empty room at uh, Valley Con and joking around about, you know, a random shit panel, and we actually gained an audience. It's uh, it's a maximum weeaboo panel at Valley Con. Welcome and talk about random stuff. Everything from Tide Pods to uh, your favorite anime and uh, what PBS stations are there. This will forever be known as the panel that didn't happen. <laughs> the panel that didn't happen, that did. Welcome up, welcome to Delta Flight 217. Service to Gensokyo, Japan. We'll be we'll be boarding uh, first and foremost our mi mi uniform mili per military personnel and ice ferries, and then we'll be boarding our premier and premier elites. Then we'll be boarding by first class and then zones. So we'll uh, take our uniformed military and ice ferries first, and then uh, you can use the sky priority lane, and then we'll uh, get to the rest in just a second. That is Delta Flight 217 to Gensokyo, Japan. Oh, I wish I was an Oscar Mayer wiener. Everyone would be in love with me. And if I was an Oscar Mayer wiener. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yo ho, Finley D. Being a pirate is alright to me. Chase Metro, then, when started, yeah. You are a pirate. Probably. But Rainer. <laughs> That is a nice picture. Um, we cannot answer that question at this time right now. Would anyone else like to ask? <laughs> Mr. Chairman, I'd like to know whether or not whether we got the... I want a beatbox for some reason. Oh my god, they came back. And you start beatboxing. Damn right, what else is there to do? This room is not occupied till 10. <laughs> We're either going to sit here, get bored, and go to Chase Masterson, or hey, it has the BMSF. And then we're just going to sit here or something like that. Okay, too. So, uh, did, you find the, did, you, did you find the stuff yet? Yeah. The stuff? I'm glad you came once again. Oh, you just went to the bathroom and yeah. wandered about and you're like, well, what else are we going to do? She's still trying to get her fangs to work. Oh. I forgot there was things that in you in you washa Naruto thing. In Yasha. Naruto washa. In Yasha. Cowboy washa. In you, basket. In you washing machine. <laughs> in you old ring, ring washer. In in you it. <laughs> oh yeah. Why not? Let's, let's have an anime about the Inuit people. We share blood, Inuit and Japanese. <laughs> Metal Gear Solid is my favorite anime. Uh, I really am partial to Inuyasha, obviously. Um, I also enjoy... <laughs> um, Full Metal Panic was good. Do you like um, Full Metal Panic from Ovo? That was cute. It was fun. Kumo It was cute. Let's get ready to rumble. Oh, yeah. You didn't say it. Oh, I didn't worry about it. You were going to say, that's not me. Oh. That's not me. Not this time. Wasn't me. Oh, yeah. That's the theme from a really good classic anime. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no, that great. Well, That's what we're gonna animate to. Does anyone else have a question about the anime? Okay. Hey, I have a question about the anime. You've never seen the episode, yeah. 
I'd like okay, to make I'm, a motion. I'm delete. I'm giving up on those right away. That was a wonderful motion. I, I second it. Oh, she seconded. Here for Personal favorite. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Yeah. That's it. Thank you. 
Interesting. <laughs> Make sure. 